You can't resist us, Mr. Powers. You can't resist us, Mr. Powers. Au contraire, baby. I think you can't resist me. What's up guys, it's your boy Benny. Story time here. I used to live in Washington DC for 15 years and I saw AOC driving her Tesla multiple times. In fact, I would go to the Whole Foods to shop which she lives directly above. So AOC lives above a Whole Foods and drives a Tesla. Amazon, Elon Musk. Yeah, okay, AOC is a total and complete fraud. Check this out. Here is a photo of AOC's Tesla uh, illegally parked in the red zone, socialist AOC slammed as hypocrite for parking her $59,000 Tesla illegally behind DC Whole Foods, one of the fanciest apartment buildings you can live in in Washington, DC. Uh, just a reminder, she is a communist, okay? So here is her Tesla. Here it is parked, not in a parking spot. And now she has even more problems at hand because, of course, this Tesla is not built by union workers and the unions are striking. That's right. Biden is going to visit uh, Michigan striking auto union workers because Donald Trump was going to do it. Small dick energy right there. The unions are striking right now. The unions have electric vehicles. So why exactly is AOC still driving a non-union made electric vehicle made by Satan incarnate Elon Musk? Well, she was asked that in a Sunday interview and it didn't go great. AOC stumbles as she's called out for owning a pricey Tesla electric vehicle rather than a union made option, insists she's looking into it. <laughs> Check out this amazing response. This was awkward 60 seconds you've seen broadcast on TV in quite some time. Watch AOC squirm harder than she did when uh, Alex Stein was calling her a big boo. Quoted Latina. back in July saying you look forward to buying a union made electric vehicle, but you buy, but you currently have a non union made mm -hmm. Tesla. UAW already makes some electric vehicles. Yes. So why wasn't that? Is it a problem with the the quality? Is it a problem with the style? Is the market just not there? Uh, no, the, our car was purchased uh, during the pandemic when travel mass, before a, a vaccine had come out. So travel between New York and Washington, the safest way that we had determined was an EV, but that was prior to um, some of the new models coming out on the market that had the range available. Uh, but we're actually looking into trading in our car now so we're looking into it and hopefully we will soon uh, we just need the range available and uh, maybe it's because i love elon musk Look, listen to the daily mail write down what she says er no uh the car purchased during the pandemic <laughs> <laughs> the vaccine had to travel between New York and Washington. The safest way was an EV. <laughs> Good old AOC. And here's another awesome photo of her car parked illegally. This is just great. She's a great communist, okay? Here's the thing. She's an amazing communist. Joseph Stalin had mansions all throughout the Soviet Union, even though it was illegal to own private property. Even though it was illegal to live in a mansion, Joseph Stalin had huge palaces built to himself, of course, like every single regime leader always does. They're always frauds. Always. Always. And they don't like the rules for you. They will break the rules. These rules are for little people. AOC is not a little person. AOC lives above Whole Foods. That's owned by Amazon. AOC, AOC prevented some like 20,000 Amazon jobs from going into her district. Remember that. Elon Musk, apparently AOC, only got a Tesla because the vaccine wasn't out yet. <laughs> AOC makes word salad breakfast and claims she bought a Tesla because the jab was not available, so it was safer that way. <laughs> Absolutely hilarious. The reason she bought a Tesla was because the vaccine had not come out yet. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. We'll be looking into trading our car in hopefully soon, she says. AOC's looking at trading her husband in soon. AOC lists fiancé as spouse on disclosures despite not being married to him. Well, what's that about? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. AOC listed her fiancé as her spouse on multiple disclosure forms with the House Ethics Committee. Even though they're not married, her office says that they're not married. This is a violation, of course, of House rules. This is an ethics violation. 
could wind her up in prison. I mean, who would who would want to be married to this ginger doofus? I don't know. Uh, but hey, you know, different strokes. Also, I thought white men were the personification of evil. Maybe I missed something. Maybe I missed something. Also, AOC seems to be into seem to be very much into uh, white men. AOC posts a lot. Well, she's into African-American men. And what I mean by that is uh, Elon Musk, who is an African and an American because he was born in South Africa. E a a o AOC, when Elon Musk bought Twitter, did an entire, like, multiple-day humiliation episode where she said that Elon Musk was censoring her Twitter account when she just simply didn't know how to use Twitter herself. And she ate some chicken uh, on camera talking about how Elon Musk is obsessed with her. I was at a community event in the Bronx in Co-op City. And when I get home, I see a text from my team saying, hey, let me know if you need any help with this Elon stuff. And I was like, what? So I pulled my Twitter app and it's like gone. Like when you pull up your mentions and stuff like that, it's just like literally like a blank screen, totally gone. And I was like, hmm, that's weird. So it turns out, we got under a certain little billionaire skin. Oh, really? Well, it looks like he wants to get under your skin. If you know what I mean. Elon Musk says, what can I say? It was a naked abuse of power. <laughs> we'll never not be funny. <laughs> ah, yes. Elon Musk has also responded multiple times uh, to memes of AOC and Elon Musk showing their extreme flirtatious chemistry. On camera, Elon Musk responding to this incredible meme with a Absolutely. Will never not be funny. <laughs> Again, Elon Musk responding with the Oh, little heart hands. Hi, hello, hello. So yeah, just a reminder that AOC, the the, the vaccine, the COVID vaccine wasn't out, so that's why she has a Tesla. <laughs> it gets too good. Oh, it's too good. We love it. We love it. We thank AOC for existing because Without it, it would be harder to prove exactly how utterly fraudulent these people are. And a reminder, AOC very much wants to, to let you know that she is not married to this person. She is single, according to her office. Although she will claim the tax benefits and fringe benefits of having a spouse, uh, if that benefits her. Another thing that communists do, of course they'll work the system to get rich. Hey! What can you do? It's your boy Benny. You can subscribe to this channel to end communism. That's what we do on this program. Although AOC is just so wildly entertaining. Like, share, and subscribe. See ya.